Okay. Butt wipes. I'm done. It's so worth. <laughs> Do you use butt wipes? No. I use regular toilet paper. And I keep going until I see nothing left. Bruh. If you're not gonna do bidet style, at least use wet wipes. So worth. So you're uh, you're really gonna keep the gun, huh? Yeah, for bears. I sometimes take a okay. shower right after. Uh, well, I and just use my hands. To haul this lot back to camp. Okay, pause, pause, pause. <laughs> Okay, listen. <clears throat> Let's say someone pooped on your forehead. A bird flew atop you and pooped right on your forehead. Okay, what would you do? Would you grab a piece of Kleenex and just keep wiping the poop off of your forehead until there was nothing left on the tissue? Probably not, right? You'd go, you'd wash your face, you'd grab some soap, a cleanser, whatever, right? Think about the same thing but for your butt. That's why, you know, use wet wipes. That's like the proper way to kind of clean something. Right? I would start with dry and then wet. Oh, that's fine. You could start dry, wet, and if you want, end with dry again. But that's so much work. As opposed to getting up, taking a shower, and wiping your butt clean? Well, sometimes the shower is just like, you know, it's a yeah, on funsies. the way thing. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I will see. I'm going to link you my favorite booty wipes. Sounds expensive, man. What? They are absolutely not. Also, the problem with like wet wipes is that since they're wet, they're a little, a little easier to like break through. And I worry that I might push too hard and <laughs> accidentally finger my. <laughs> Sir, wet wipes are typically thicker than like two ply toilet paper. Come on now. This is the wildest convo I've ever had on a sponsored stream. Thank you again for sponsoring us to play together. Thank you.